Hey, what's going on Guardians TBL here, and by now you guys probably already know the Destiny 2 PC beta is live, it has begun, and it is actually pretty darn good. But for those of you out there who've had a chance to play the beta, some of you might have experienced a few issues with optimization, specifically concerning keeping a stable frame rate while running off of fairly high-end hardware. I was streaming the game earlier today and I noticed I was having a rough time keeping frame rates stable and above 60 frames per second, and I've got a fairly high-end system. I'm running it on a GTX 1080 Ti as well as an AMD Ryzen 1700X. So there was really no reason for me to be experiencing some of the performance bugs that I was. So I did a little bit of playing around, did some optimizing, and I found some settings that caused the game to run as smooth as possible. And I figured I'd make a quick video just talking about a few of those options. Hopefully it helps some of you guys out there. First things first, Destiny's optimization options are fairly extensive. But there are a few things you can play around in here that should help with your overall performance. First things first, running it in full screen mode can probably lighten the load overall on your CPU or GPU. Beyond that, you'll of course want to play around with some of the available presets based on the hardware that you've got available. Destiny 2 seems to be really well optimized, and I've even been seeing people on old GTX 970s being able to play the game on the highest settings. But if you've got the hardware required to run this game on either the high or highest settings, but you've been noticing some really inexplicable frame drops, try changing the anti-aliasing from MSAA over to SMAA. Doing this, I noticed an immediate jump in my overall performance. Whereas before, in open world zones, when I was surrounded by enemies, I was getting maybe an average of 50 to 55 frames per second. By switching over to SMAA, that doubled my frame rate back to really where it should have been, well above 100. And like I said, it immediately boosted my overall performance. Now this doesn't come as a complete surprise. Bungie put out an article a few days ago covering some of the known issues with the Destiny 2 PC beta, and on that list was MSAA. They stated that MSAA in the Destiny 2 PC beta is still a work in progress. Compatibility with this feature will continue to be optimized leading up to the full Destiny 2 launch on PC on October 24th. Now, why exactly this caused problems for me, I'm not exactly sure. Again, I have a fairly high-end rig. But swapping that over to SMAA immediately smoothed the experience out. I was getting the kinds of frame rates that I would expect from a rig like mine, even at 4K. And from what I've read online in the subreddit and the Bungie forums and elsewhere across the internet from people who've been playing the Destiny 2 PC beta, this has been a solution that's worked for quite a few Guardians out there. So, I figured I'd make a quick video pointing it out. It helped me, and hopefully if you've been having some problems optimizing Destiny 2 on the PC, this will help you stabilize those frame rates. But alright, that's it for this one, Guardians. Hopefully it helped out, and if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. But anyways, I'm out for now. Thanks so much for watching, and as always, I am the Black Link. You Guardians, stay frosty.